Hello internet friends, this is a video I promised looking at my reshade settings, but before I did that I thought I'd show you some of the cool effects. This is one of my favourites, the cartoon stuff. It's the most obvious, but it turns everything so that it looks kind of cell drawn. I really love it. But you can do all kinds of crazy things like putting the motion blur on, like so we can recreate the Return of the Jedi and get the sense. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm going that fast. I'm not really going quite that fast. And some of the effects look pretty cool, actually. The lightning there when it's got the black line around it. And it's been cartoonified. And you can go really crazy and do really silly things like turn it so that it's really stylized. This is all the like extreme stuff, but there's even weirder things like you can turn all of the graphics on screen into ASCII letters. You can do night vision. You can do all kinds of things. And as you see, when I was bringing up the menu there, you can kind of search. Some of them are titled quite intuitive things. So if, you, if there's an effect you can think of, you can kind of type in and search for it. Anyway, without further ado, I'll show you what I have my settings on, which are a lot more sensible than these silly things. Okay, so as promised, here are my settings. I would encourage you to play around, though beauty is in the eye of the beholder and what looks good to me might not look good to you. There are so many options. It's almost like painting, you know, what looks, what someone is attracted to might <laughs> repel someone else. Uh, but anyway, let's have a look at what I've put on. And mine is pretty straightforward, so I don't need to put the preset up necessarily. I haven't done any of this fine tuning down here. I've just clicked on a few of these and I'm going for, I like it to look clear. So I haven't got any bloom or any fancy effects on. I've just got stuff on that sharpens the image because and, and makes it more high contrast. So the first thing is adaptive sharpen. So I've got that one on. And then coming all the way down to clarity, I actually have two clarities on there. Uh, I'm not sure exactly why. Right, it makes it a little bit brighter, a little bit sharper if you put both on. Uh, what's the next one? HDR, fake HDR. Yeah, so that just adds some contrast. And the the main one that I think makes a big difference is vibrancy. So vibrance right down at the bottom. Yeah, probably the HDR makes the biggest difference. And that that's it. Those, what is it? Four, one, two, three, four, five, I think. Adaptive Sharpen. So those are my settings. Let me know if you think you might use them or what tweaks you're going to make of your own. These two videos were initially inspired by the fact that ILM has gone from the launcher in Star Wars Galaxy's Legends. But quite a number of people have let me know that there is a way to get ILM working again in the state that it was when it's, it was taken off the launcher. It's a workaround, basically. I'm not going to put it in this video, however, because I think that is something that people might search and it needs its own video so I can title it properly and people can find it through search. So I'm going to do a third video in what has become this mini series and uh, post that up very soon. Uh, so stick around for that. And again, I will link it here once it's ready. So click on that if you want to get ILM working in the interim. However, I would say as far as I know, it's not being actively developed for anymore. So there may come a time in the future where the workaround doesn't work. I, if that is the case, personally, I feel like I just want to do without ILM at this stage and make do with reshade because I don't like, I never like, because I never like the idea that something that I'm attached to is going to go away. And when it's not been actively developed, that's kind of a, a looming shadow, but that's my personal preference. Anyway, stay tuned for that extra video and I will see you soon. Bye.